Anthony Huckerson, King of Spice is back. So tonight we've got another hot sauce review, but it's got a little bit of a twist. So I'll tell you what we're reviewing tonight. We've got Blaze Ultra Death. Got that roof? Yep. Yeah. My eyes aren't very good. Right, so uh, we're going to review this sauce, but the twist is um, an old pal I used to go to school with, um, he's got a bottle of this and he says it's really, really hot. I've never tried it, so I don't know. I brought it from um, the Psycho Juice website for nine pound a bottle. The packaging's really good, so that's yeah. So it's good packaging, good price as well. He says to have a teaspoon or an egg spoon. We haven't got an egg spoon. This is a this is a teaspoon, Ruth. Yeah. Yep, teaspoon. So if I have a teaspoon of it and wait a minute. For every teaspoon after that, with a minute in between, no drink. No drink. He's gonna give ten pound to a local charity. Um, did I mention his name? Dean Mellers, and he's gonna be donating to a local charity, at Ilkeston Charity. It's called Ben's Den. So I was gonna say, well, I did say that I reckon I'll do five spoons of this or six spoons, 50 quid for charity, but since I've brought it and actually read it, it's got a pepper extract in. Um, I've had two pepper extracts before, not in a sauce though, so I think I'll be all right, but this has got a pepper extract in, not a pure pepper extract, but I've tried before, is what I'm trying to say. So we're gonna try and have as many spoonfuls as we can. I've definitely had two to raise 10 pounds for charity, and we'll see how we get on. This is sealed, so. What are you drinking, or oh, not? Oh yeah, shit, <laughs> what am I drinking, Ruth? So I've got milk, I don't know, I don't know how right up it's been. Will I need the milk, will I not? It's there. Oh yeah, that's the thing as well, I'm not allowed to drink at anything. All while I'm doing the, the, the challenge that's been set, but after I've submitted defeat. Cause in a, a lot, a little, sorry, in a lot of challenges, they let you drink water to get it down, don't they? But I think they're eating challenges, not hot. No, like if you have, if you have a chilli oh, to get know. it down. Oh, I don't know, I don't know. But anyway, I've got milk, it's, uh, what milk do I have, Ruth? Uh, red top. <laughs> red top, for the, trying to slim down, yeah. And I've also got a, a nice gin and tonic tonight. It's an uh, it's eleven hour gin. I don't know if you'll even be off to get it anymore. I've saved this. I've had it since my birthday. Um, it's a special. No good at Christmas. No, did I? Yeah. Anyway, I've saved this. It's a limited batch. One of them things. So, right. Let's see how to get in this. So there's a sticker here. I don't know really break the box, but right. I mean, that were easy. Are you doing on percentage on that iPad? Not 9%. Right, I'm panicking because it's it, it's running out of battery and I don't right. want to ruin the we challenge. Are, so we are, we're talking real deal, Ian Beale. It's, it's still in its packaging. Oh, you get a bracelet charm on it. You get a little, um, get a little quirky skull. I think you should sell them in partners for about 29p back in the day. Oh, sorry. Yeah? Yeah. So, um, right. Christ. I'll give you a quick read from, <laughs> I'll give you a quick read from the instructions. Anyway, uh, we've got habanero pepper, Carolina reaper pepper, cayenne pepper, vinegar, serrano pepper, salt, pepper extract, is that's what I was telling you about, tomato puree, acidic acid, ghost pepper, scorpion peppers, fresh garlic, food starch, that would make it thicker, uh, spices and smells. Can't read them. It says due to the freshness of this product, colours may and consistency may vary. So if this is a different colour or a consistency to yours, Dean, that's why. It. But it's legit. I took the took the took it all off. Right, let's just get it done before Ruth has a heart attack and a thingy. <laughs> I just don't want it to be my fault. Smells tomatoey. If I can, don't smell hot. It smells quite pleasant. Right. But it looks can be deceiving. So yeah, I don't know if it's a thick, gloopy one. 
Are you stalling? Oh, sorry. So pepper extracts are normally black and thick and horrible and they're just not very nice at all. This feels like it's quite runny. I don't know how much is going to be in it. Pepper extract or what it is. Is that a nice full spoon? Well, I, I reckon so. I mean, he says it don't need to be dripping over the sides. Okay. So, um, Sorry, I've got a squeaky chair again. Okay, so the first one's a freebie. Yeah? Yeah. Happy time. It's hot. Is it tomato? -y? Yeah, sir. It's tomato. -y. I mean, it's not the hottest sauce I've ever had in the world. It is hot. At the back of my throat a bit. The saliva's there straight away, which you know is going to be hot. Uh, with a hot sauce, sorry. Not much building up at the minute, but it is hot. Like right, so, yeah. um, spice wise, on one spoonful, because that's normally what we do, we'll just give it one spoonful and then we give it a spice rating. I'm on about, about a six. Minute. Minute. Don't want about six for one spoonful. I'll definitely do another spoonful. Yeah. Building up a little bit. Well, that's the biggest spoon. That's the biggest spoon. Right, the balls are getting bigger apparently. Shaking a little bit. Are you scared? It's quite garlicky, actually. Second spoonful. Sorry about my hair, lockdown hair. Uh, second spoonful. Wow. Um, probably. Ooh, that's right at the back. Probably creeping up to about seven. Maybe a seven and a half, something like that. Um, I watched a review on this, and they put it hotter than the. Uh, the regret hot sauce. Oh, was that a little ear going? Yeah, a little bit. <laughs> they put it um, hotter than the regret hot sauce. I don't know. I'm not sure. <sighs> yeah, definitely gone a little bit red in the face, Ruth. Who, me? No, me. Oh. <laughs> um, yeah, it's hot. So, £10 for charity, yeah? You happy? Well, I'm happy. Go on. So we have one more. Yeah. By the way, that's about five, 10 seconds over. Well, you are faffing around, so I'm not counting it. Because I'm doing it fair. It's hot. This is the last one, I think. Yeah, you happy? Yep. You've not reset it, so we're just going to go up to two minutes. Oh, yeah. We had a semi-heated debate about how you use a stopwatch. Three spoonfuls of that's not. Do you want to talk about how you prepared for this challenge? No. Oh. Oh, yeah. I'm up in the eights, I think, now. On that. Oh. What does it taste of? It's actually quite nice. My eyes are in there. It is actually quite nice, but one spoonful on something would be quite nice, but it's built from no from no I'm not doing one more. She'd be on the camera doing one more. <laughs> one more. I don't think you should. No, twenty quid's fine. I'm happy with twenty quid. Um two minutes, plus the additional minute. So I could do one more spoonful. But I'm not going to. I could, no, Ruth, she sat behind there going, 20 quid's all right, my ears are quite hot. Um, I tell you what, I'm not doing no, no more spoonfuls, but if anybody local wants to buy a bottle of it, 
and do the same challenge. I'll adhere the same rules if they want to do it. Yeah. Buy your own bottle. And quite yeah. someone drinks a full bottle. No, we do spoonfuls. I go up to fifty quid as well. I'm not. I'm not. Like I'm not fifty pounds enough for my money for a charity. So if someone wants to have a go at it, buy a bottle and I'll adhere to it. So thanks for the challenge, Dean. Yeah. Um, and you've like you say, you've raised twenty quid for Ben's Den, and someone else might. Oh, fuck yeah, it's hot. Yeah, it's hot. <sighs> yeah. So. Oh. I can see your eyes running. <laughs> yeah, it's definitely built up a bit. Um, yeah. So thanks for that. We'll see you next week on another King of Spicy, Spicy King. Bye. Oh, I haven't recorded it. Put off roof. <laughs>